Another unemployment scheme broken up in Maryland, this time targeting high-ranking government officials, including Governor Hogan. Amy Kawada with the investigation underway and the message from the governor. Maryland's highest ranking officials among the latest targets in another unemployment insurance fraud scheme uncovered by the state. The governor's office announced Wednesday the scheme targeted Governor Larry Hogan, Lieutenant Governor Boyd Rutherford, Labor Secretary Tiffany Robinson, and several other members of the governor's cabinet. Officials say the fraudulent claims filed used stolen identities, and when detected, they were immediately blocked. Governor Larry Hogan tweeting this kind of fraud truly can happen to anyone, and we need to remain vigilant. Truly, we are at war with these kind of malicious hackers, and unless we get more prepared and proactive, we're going to see this continue. With a record number of Marylanders out of work due to COVID-19, cybersecurity attorney Spencer Pollock says hackers have taken advantage of the vulnerable. So it was almost a perfect storm where you get the influx of claims, and then you have a lot of personal information already out there. This follows another fraud scheme in July when the governor announced more than 47,000 fraudulent claims were filed in Maryland, totaling over $500 million. Officials say a comprehensive investigation is underway into this most recent case. The State Department of Labor is also cross checking all applicants who claim the state of Maryland was their last employer. If you believe your information has been used to fraudulently file an unemployment claim, officials encourage you to contact the State Department of Labor's Division of Unemployment Insurance through email. For WJZ, I'm Amy Kawada.